Hi guys, <clears throat> and welcome back to Vintage Story. We are now on episode 5, and let's go ahead and get started. I hope you guys are doing well, staying safe, staying happy, all of that good stuff, and more importantly, stay hydrated. Um, I know I have to remember to do that because, you know, I am talking a lot, and sometimes I forget while I'm playing to, you know, take a drink of water, because I'm my hands are always busy, you know, playing and stuff. So, um, we're going to go ahead and continue where we left off. So, on our last episode, um, I showed you guys how to make the meals. We have our charcoal pit, which was going, but it looks like I don't see the smoke now. So, guess what, chat? You guys came at the perfect time. Our charcoal pit is ready, so I'm going to show you that. We're going to expose the dirt, and then you should see some charred firewood. We looks like we have another fish. And our crops are doing okay. It looks like they're going to need to see how, remember how they were 100%? Now it looks like, yeah, they're going to need some water. So we're going to do some watering. Um, we do need to get some food in us. Our bowl is now empty. Um, so what I want to do today um, for our goal, um, I would like to, um, we do seriously need to find some peat i mean yeah if we find some seeds that's also great but i'm not too worried about the seeds we do our berries are going to be ready here shortly so we'll have plenty of berries we do have plenty of um, meat in our crock pot so it's not like we're starving for food um so we're okay on food so i'm not worried about the seeds but we do need to find peat just so we know where a um, resource of that is. So we need to find peat in, um, what was it else that I wanted to do? So we want to find peat and we're going to do the charcoal. Um, I said we can get some seeds, but that's not that important. So, uh, let's go ahead and just get this fish really quick here. And he took the last of the bait. That's why I have an extra bait on me. I kind of knew he would take it. There we go. So we rebaited that. Um, let's see here. Oh yeah, we need to do more clay forming. That's what we're going to do. So we're going to do a little bit of clay forming, but we're going to go and hunt for, um, we're going to hunt for peat first, because honestly that's very important in this game. Instead of wasting all of our firewood, I would really really like to find some peat and mark it on the map for us so we have enough food we don't have to worry about food for right now um yeah so if we find seeds on the way that's great if not it's not a big deal uh, we can definitely do clay forming when we're here at the home um safe or whatever um I'm trying to think if i need anything um I'm going to make a little bit more sticks while we're out. I just like to have a lot of ladders as much as I can. Um, we're not going to do caving, so I'm not too worried about the whole torches thing. I just like to have the ladders um, on us. Um, but we might water really quick uh, because we want to protect our crops. And it won't take that long to water. It's really quick. We'll do that before we go. Because, oh, oh, I didn't realize. Okay, so now it's, wow, it's already like almost 7 o'clock at night. So, because I'm thinking it's already too late to go out, what we can do is we'll do our clay farming now. As soon as it hits morning, chat, we're going to go ahead and be productive. And we will go ahead and hunt for Pete. So, yeah, I didn't realize because of the time when we left it from the last episode. So we're going to go ahead after we water these plants, we're going to go ahead and do some more clay forming because we made our bowls, we made our cooking pot, but we need another cooking pot. What we really need to focus on now that we have our charcoal, oh, we need to do our charcoal too. We need to focus on making our tool molds. So like we need the hammer mold, the pickaxe, the shovel, the ax, um, maybe do some fishing hooks, fishing, lo fishing stuff. Um, but we definitely need We'll have to get more clay as well because we're going to need the anvil 
and all that stuff. We need a lot of stuff, basically, chat. So we need to do lots of clay forming. And we only have that one stack of uh, clay of the blue, and then we have, I think, two of the red. Um, but one of them is pretty much going to go toward the fire clay oven, because it takes a lot. Um, so we're going to probably have to get some more blue clay. And we know where blue clay is. We have a few... We have a few places marked on the map. We have one right by the house. And then we have one where, um, remember where the animals were? When we were getting, we were hunting the animals. Where was that? Yeah, over here. So the animals are here and the clay is like right over here. But this one's closer. So we'll go here, but this one is right across from where the animals are. And it would be nice if we could find some more ruins um, so we can see scavenge from there um what is this over here well i know that that's clay but i don't know if that's red or blue but it doesn't matter i'm not worried about going going from here all the way over there we have clay like right here and right here so we're good on we're good on clay yep monsters are going to be coming here shortly because after tonight when it turns tomorrow the next day we're gonna have one more day so yeah drifters are gonna come so we need to definitely hurry up and you know that's why we had to get our home and at least be safe um because the drifters are gonna come and i had it set for 10 days so let's go ahead and take a peek at our charcoal see and you know you did it correctly is when you see the when you see the firewood like that when it's charred like that so you know that you did it properly if you didn't do it right you would just see your regular firewood so we did it correctly I probably I probably could just keep the on top because we have to use it to cover it cover in it anyways But we gotta break this. Because we gotta get into our firewood. So look at this. This this noise chat is like so satisfying. Listen to it. When you're breaking the charcoal. Listen to the noise. Oh, that is so satisfying. I love that noise. Like even the sound of like the fire is just so awesome. But this noise, oh, that's just awesome. So we don't have a lot, like I said, it's not a lot of charcoal, but it's something. Honestly, it got us something to get us started. So we can always put more wood in here later. Did I get everything? Yep. We got 26 pieces of charcoal. So I would say that's not too bad. We're going to go ahead and keep this with the wood. So yeah. So if we do our first smelting, like for... The pickaxe and the the hammer. So we'll need 20, 20 nuggets of copper for the hammer. 20 nuggets for the pickaxe. But because we have a tin location, um, we might be able to... Um, um, if we can find enough tin. But I think we... Did we only have that one spot that we found tin when we first started right by our spawn? That might only be... Well, if we have two nuggets, we might be okay. I mean, if we have two spots that we found tin, did we only find one? Or do we have two? Because if we have two, I only need two pieces of tin and 18 copper to make a tin bronze. Okay, so honestly, we might have enough for one. If, if I can get two nuggets out of that, we'll be set. So what we can do is we can do a copper hammer... And then do a tin bronze pickaxe. That will last a little bit longer and be stronger. Because we, we do have our copper locations. We got one, two, three, four, five. We have five locations. But there was one location that had a whole bunch. Remember? If you remember. So we have at least five. Five spots. Okay, so 
Uh, the monsters are going to come here soon. Let's go ahead and see. It's not too... Well, it is dark, but it's not too dark. Where was that? Um, we need to get a little bit more clay because we only have the one of the blue. Let's just, get, let's just get a little bit more. It's right over here. Before the monster, before the monsters come, it was over here. But I mean, I know it was a small deposit. Was that it? Did I like literally grab it all? Is that it? Oh, see, there's some more here. I thought that was all. Well, I mean, it is. It was a really small deposit, honestly. If anything, I could always get more fire clay. I might just do that since we're already, we're already out. And get a little bit more of this dirt. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing well. And, you know, comment down below. Like, out of everything that we've done so far. Like, we've been hunting. We've been farming. We've done the charcoal. We've done the fishing stuff. Um, we've done the building cooking like out of everything that we've done so far what would you guys say is like the one thing if you were to get this game like what are you looking forward to doing in vintage story like when you get this game because we haven't done any exploring but we will uh, but there's just so much to do in this game i'm just curious like what are you guys looking forward to uh, ex experiencing and like doing you know, in this kind of, in this kind of game. I love exploring. I love the cooking. I love the farming. I pretty much love everything about the game. Even like the, even like this, the silliest task, like even just like collecting resources is pretty fun to me. I know it's really nerdy, but you know, this game is just too awesome. I think everything is fun in this game. This game is just too awesome. Like, because I've played this, honestly, I used to play Minecraft a little bit. I got into it um, a while ago, and yeah, it was fun. But then once you play this game, I'll tell you the truth, you really can't go back to Minecraft after playing this. Because I tried um, just to test it out and see if I could do it. I literally loaded up my Minecraft, right? And I got into my world, and I was just like, I loaded in, and I was looking around, and yeah, I've done a few cool buildings and done things, like I made a house and all this stuff. And then I'm looking around, and like, literally, I was only in the game like two minutes, and like, I lost interest. <laughs> That's how sad it was. Like, I literally was like, I don't want to play this. I mean, I really wanted to try. I really, really did want to. But as soon as I just started, you know, looking around and like, I was like, what am I going to do? And then I just, I just lost interest. I don't know. I just thought it was really funny. Like, I just, I really can't play that anymore. It just doesn't get me excited. You know, like in this game, like animals actually run away. Like they have like real instincts. Like, look at this rabbit. If I get close to it, it's going to run away. Oh, that's not a rabbit. I thought it was a rabbit. Uh, but we're going to get that shell because... We can grind those up later in the future. You can turn that into lime, the shell. You can turn that into lime. Okay, so we are full, our inventory. So we're going to go... We're going to go home. I need one more piece of dirt. One more dirt. So yeah, so yeah. I can't play, I can't play Minecraft anymore after playing this. This game is just too cool where... Anything else, it just doesn't compare. It's just, it's crazy. So I don't know if any of you have ever played this and then also... See, one more day for monsters. I don't know if you guys did try to do that as well. Like, you played Minecraft before, but now that you've played this, you're just like, you lost interest in Minecraft now. Because I literally did. I didn't know that was going to happen, but it li literally did happen. Because I'm not excited to go play it. 
it's kind of funny. <laughs> okay, so it's nighttime now. We're going to go ahead and take advantage of that and do clay forming, like I said. But we got lots of clay now. We got, um, honestly, we took the rest. Okay, we're going to go unmark that on the map because we took all the rest of that blue, blue clay. So all that's left now is just gravel in that area. So we'll have to travel back here if I want more blue clay. But because we have all the red clay, we're going to honestly use the red clay since I have it. I'm not going to, I'm not going to waste it. Um, we're going to, you know how it is. Like I told you guys, we use what we have. We don't waste nothing. Um, I might move dirt because we do have a lot of inventory space. Um... Well, not the wood one. This one I don't want to put. This one is for seeds. I mean, these ones are for panning. I guess we could put just regular dirt in here. Um, but we just got to wait till we get more chests. Okay. So that's going to be the blue, blue, the fire, blue clay, and then we got all this red clay. Okay, let's just go ahead and do the red clay for now. What are we missing here? Oh, okay, shovels. Yeah, we used our shovels. Okay, so we don't have a shovel here. We don't have a shovel there. Oh, that was another thing I told you guys we had to do. We need to make more tools. We're, like, low on tools uh, because we've been using everything, which is not a problem. We need to make some shovels. Let's go ahead and do that because I don't have any in my inventory. We just used it getting all that clay clay and dirt. Okay, so now we have some shovels, right? One for back up, one for our toolbar. And we're going to need a few more other tools because, like, our tool racks are missing tools as well. So, like, yeah, I have some on me, but you know how I am. I like to have it on my tool rack for when I need them. I don't have to make them. Like, I don't like to make them every time I need them. I like to have a kind of like a backstop. I like to be prepared. And we'll probably make some more spears, too, because we are hunting. And my spears are kind of a little low. Two or three of them are kind of ready been used for getting all those pigs. And we're going to need more because we were getting all that wood earlier. I kind of like the napping. It's fun. I think it's a really interesting mechanic in the game as well as blacksmithing. I think you guys are going to love when I do the blacksmithing. You're going to love it. We need more knives as well. We need everything. Because I used the knives when I was harvesting and then we were uh, getting all that grass. Remember when we got all that grass? I never made more tools. My inventory was full. <laughs> okay, let's go put... Let's go put this step away. Okay, so it's starting to be morning, so that's, that's, that's good for us. Um, 
these ones are extra. We already have two shovels there. Maybe I made one shovel too much. I mean, we'll use it, obviously. So that's new. That's new. That's new. Okay, so... We'll just put this over here. Since we have an extra one. Uh, see, this one's really low. That's low, but we have a fresh one and then we have the copper one. Okay, I think we're good. Let's go make a few... Um, now that we got our tools out of the way... Let's hurry up so so we can not waste the day we need to find Pete. Like, not even kidding. Not even kidding. No goofing around. So we need to make another... At least one more cooking pot. You know what I mean? Um, we need... See, we need the clay oven. That's going to take a lot. Um, but we'll do that later. Um, we need one more bowl. Because it's good to have at least two bowls. I mean, three is preferable, but... We, we can get away with two. That way... If we keep one on the fire, we can use one to keep making continuous meals. You know what I mean? So we need at least two. I don't, I don't really think I need three or four because I'm not going to be making a whole bunch of meals at once. And if I do, it's, I, I can get away with two. Okay. I could always make more bowls too because we're going to need more, lots of oil herbs. Um... We don't have a jug. I didn't make a jug. Because when we have all those berries, we can make some juice and we can drink out of that. We can put the juice in this jug. The copy tool is your best friend. Trust me. You just have to hold down right click and it will do it automatically for you. Okay, cool. So we got one jug. That's all. We only need one. And... We'll probably do, um, we still have a couple, a few bowls left over. We're going to do a couple more crocs because we're going to always be using, making food. So we need, we need to have the croc pot. Because we don't want to fire the kiln just two little items. So we want to make sure we fill it up because we're using our grass and our sticks. So we can go ahead and just do uh, two of these crops to take up those other two slots or spots, whatever. Okay, so there's one. We need one more. That way we're not wasting anything. We got two. We can definitely use another vessel too, but I don't want to spend too much time with the clay forming because I, I want to get I want to get on the road and I want to go find that uh, peat deposit because we don't know where the peat is, so we're gonna have to search for it. 
I've, I've looked on the map and sometimes you can tell it's like a little darker area but honestly sometimes it's over here on like the sides of the bank of the you know and you never know i mean this like this dark area that could be p but that's kind of far um i want to stick closer to home um so that's why we're just gonna have to explore like this whole mountain ridge like this whole area right here all of this grass grassy area we're gonna go ahead and focus we're just gonna kind of do like a, a, where this animals are we're gonna kind of do like a loop over here if we don't find it here we're gonna look over here in this um, grassy area so um so yeah so like i said we just we're gonna take a look but we don't want to go too far from home i want to stick somewhat close to home and keep this episode short um we haven't done um all we've done is clay forming we haven't found any peat yet um so like i was saying we do need to do some tool molds but the most important ones we're just going to do those we need the hammer and the pickaxe so we're just going to do those really quick and knock these out so we can get out of here because it's now like six o'clock in the morning in our game now and we haven't gone anywhere um, but it's okay i mean we are still being productive where we do need these things uh, so that way we can actually use this when we get some um when i actually do get some ores we can actually smelt and get some nice tools so it's not like we're doing nothing we are we are being productive okay my inventory is pretty full we need to go ahead and place some items down just so we can make some more stuff because, you know, I can't just hold a lot of stuff without any space. Okay. Okay, that works. Okay, now we need the pickaxe. It's so hard to see. Oh my god. Because it's like the morning time and it's like so bright. That's why at night is like the best time to see it. Because the voxels really light up. Um, but it turned day on us. So we have no choice. I don't know if you guys can see. But I can see. It's still hard to see. But I mean I, I could see. We're going to be done here in a sec. I'm just going to make... I'll probably definitely... Because now that we're going to have monsters spawning, the drifters... Um, I'm going to want to have a fox blade as well. Kind of like a knife. Because uh, I usually use that um, the fox blade as my weapon when I do see them. If I'm up close with them. I mean, yeah, I'll throw spears at them sometimes. But I prefer just to go head on and just like hit him with the axe and then you know hit him step back hit him step back that's how i usually get them but if there's a lot of them i kind of have to stay back and kite them so i you know i don't want to die but i like to use this so that's why i'm gonna make sure we have this the axe and the the axe and the shovel mold can kind of wait because i i'm okay making my cheap little you know my little flint flint shovels and flint axes i'm okay with that because it's easy and fast and convenient uh, but of course you know the copper ones are gonna last longer you know what i mean okay so do we have everything that i want so far let me check um, of course we're going to need the anvil mold, but I'm not worried about that because we don't have copper. I could definitely use another um, storage vessel, but that can wait. Um, I wanted to do... We could easily make the fish hooks with our flint. Um, so, so, yeah. so You can get the mold that does the fishing hooks, but we need the lure. Fishing lure. We can't do the lure with, um, with our flint. So we're going to go ahead and pick this one. 
So that way we can attach these, <coughs> excuse me, to our hooks and it will basically attract the fish even better and faster, I guess. So we're going to do this one. It's not necessarily 100% important, but I mean, if we are doing fishing, might as well have it, I guess is my point. If you're not fishing or care about the fish part of the game, then yeah, you don't need it. But we do because we we have the trot line and I want to make fishing baskets later. We just need to get some rope. Okay, so now we got the lure. I think... <coughs> Excuse me. I think we have room for one more thing though. Might as well make something. If we have that one, we don't want to waste um, the spot. Um, I think I'll do another pickaxe mold because honestly, I always have two. Honestly, um, because pickaxes I use the most. I I only do one hammer, but I always have two pickaxes. So honestly, might as well do it because I always have two on me. When I do smelting. I always smelt to it one time. Because you know. You'll go through it very fast. Trust me. And then we'll. I think we can get these fired up. If not. At least we did them now. Oh actually. Wait is that the one that's empty? I think so. Let me see. Okay, they're all full. Okay. And we only had, look, one piece of clay left over. So actually, that's good that we stopped anyways. We only had one piece left on that one. On that fire one. Let's go ahead and grab our stack of sticks. And stack of grass. And we need our firewood, of course. And then we'll go ahead and light this sucker up and we'll get out of here. Next we'll have to do the anvil and maybe one or two storage vessels when we do the clay next time on our, our next clay, um, clay when we're doing our next clay making. But for now we're pretty good. I mean, we got the one vessel, so we're okay. This is so satisfying and so fun to like light up and like hear it crackle. I love that noise. Let's go ahead and light these up. And like I said, my farm is, my house is protected because of the pack dirt and also our bushes. So our bushes aren't going to get on fire. So we're all set and it has a roof, obviously. So our crops will be fine and these are not going to go out if it starts to rain when we're out. <laughs> I got to step back a little bit. I don't want to catch on fire. Okay, we're good to go. We got to stay with the stay away from the fire so we don't kill ourselves because I have run into the my fire before plenty of times okay so we are like I said running low on sticks and grass uh, because you do use a lot of it just to um, do clay forming it really goes fast so you guys can see that so that's why you always see me like if I'm on the way home I'll like just grab some grass or I'll grab some sticks because um, now you guys actually see that it does go pretty quick okay now that we got our charcoal out of our charcoal pit we did more clay um, forming we also started it in the pit kiln now I would love see we got some grass here um, we'll have to water when we get back. Um, 
I seriously want to find... I want to go over... See, this area, we don't want to go over here because it's all gravel, right? We want to go in this grassy area. That's where the peat's going to be. So we're going to just have to just hope we can find some. And you can tell what it looks like. It's like a dark, dark brown. It's very dark. I like that. Look at that mountain or that little upside down, like floating, floating little like mountain area. It's pretty cool. Doesn't seem realistic, but it's cool. So let's just go crazy. And if you guys, if you guys see any hollows that I missed, be sure to put that in the comment below and let me know because we're going to be just running around crazy. And we have to look out for um, ores as well, like copper, copper locations, you know, or any kind of, um, not just copper, but like if you see tin, like if you, if you see anything like in your view when I was running past something, let me know. Just put down where the coordinates are and let me know. I'd really appreciate it because sometimes playing this, I might not see something, but you guys might see something that I missed. So definitely let me know if I ever miss anything that's important. Okay, so we're going to look. See, we're just trying to follow the, the outskirts of the mountain to see if we could find any peat that's generated. Let me guess, another cave. See a hole. Okay, so it is a hole. Um, too bad there's no animals in there. I guess I could um, use this as a... Um, I'm going to write this as a um, animal pit trap. So, um, what I could do is, like, if an animal is chasing me, like a bear, I could, like, lure him over here, and then hopefully he falls in. And then I could just get my way out by, um, by a ladder, but I mean, I don't want to fall on there and die, so... That's what I'm saying. I have to have. I have to be prepared. I have to have a ladder set up for me. So let's say I just fall right here, just at the bottom here. But they're gonna jump in there and try to get me. Well, well, I don't know. If it's a bear, he can. I don't know if he can get out, but he'll probably would fall way down there. And I'm just gonna set it here for me. Or if it's a wolf, he's gonna fall down there. He's not gonna be able to jump up this high, or he can't get on the ladder. But he can. Wolves can't jump up too high, but. Yeah. Let me see. So if I... F oh, well, I guess I already fell. There we go. Um, but if I'm here, I can jump from here, 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 here. And then... I can go from here and then just like... I don't know. Let me see. Let me test something out. Because, I mean, if I fall in here to get them trapped, I have to make sure I'm able to get out. You know what I mean? I'm going to put this here, so if I go... Yeah, I can get out. Okay. So we have one here, we have one here. Okay, we're set. No more goofing around. Um, I want... I want to find that peat. Because we... Oh, <gasps> you guys! Look straight ahead. Oh, hello! Oh my god. I hope it has some good seeds in there. Let's go over here and just see what's over here. I got berries because I saw those berries. Oh my lord, you guys. You guys know I get freaking excited. I wonder what's in there. Oh, <gasps> sunflower seeds, chat. We don't have sunflower seeds. Yes. Let's go ahead and try to get some of these branches. Oh, actually, no, I want to conserve my space. Let's just get let's just get what we have from here. Whoa. Sunflower seeds. Don't tell me it's just one seed. Ooh, I see mushrooms over there on that tree. Okay, so we got the hollow, which is like honestly, yeah. Oh my god, it was only one seed. What the heck? 
I mean, it's better than nothing. I guess I can't complain. Um, but it's not much. I, I need to put this away, you guys, because our inventory. So we're going to put those away. I don't need that food. I have my regular food. We're going to put that away because we can only carry one. Um, sticks I might keep on me and then the wood because we'll probably get more. So we'll do that. Okay. Let's get out of here. I'm going to go to that other tree because there was mushrooms. And we're going to need, like I said, we don't have very many vegetables. So I got to take whatever we can find. Um, so we're going to take those mushrooms. But we are, while we're looking around, we're looking for Pete. Because I can see Pete from far away, if, it, if it's there. What is this? Oh, we already have red... Oh, we have red currants in our inventory. In our backpack. But I just put it away. Okay, next time we go. Um, I might... I don't know if I should get these berries, because that's another inventory spot. I mean, we have the space... I guess. I'm not going to pick them up and plant them, but yeah, I guess I'll pick it up. <gasps> I heard wolves. Okay, I see... I see fox. I see foxes. I don't actually see wolves. We haven't seen a wolf yet, chat. We've heard them, but we haven't, like, seen one. Or I haven't killed one. I'm not scared of them. I just, we haven't seen one yet. I mean, I hear them. But do you see how this is all full of, like, granite? It's just all mountainy area. We need to find that peat. And that's usually in the grassy areas. Um, let's go ahead and get those mushrooms. What's down there? Is that a hole? What is that? Oh, it's just dirt. There's nothing. I thought it was like a hole going down because, you know, sometimes you can find like treasure rooms or something like, you know, something. Let's get these tinder hoofs. Because these are going to be food. We're going to use this for our meal making. When we make some food, it's going to be great. There's another one here. Mushrooms are very good. They have very good um, saturation. Satiation. Let's see here. So 80 sat for the vegetables. Because um, some are like 30, 50. 80 is not bad. Look at that. Look at that rabbit just chilling over there. I want to check this tree just to make sure it's not a hollow as well. But we also have, um, we're going to need lots of wood. Um, I already have wood on my inventory, so I might as well get this. And yeah, it's not a hollow. Um, our inventory is full. I think I'm going to go ahead and plant this seed. Just to not take it home with us. We have some in our inventory at home. Um, that fox is chasing that rabbit. gonna put all those see all those um, currents we have with them put those there uh, I think that's good for now actually I don't want to have the torches I mean just in case you know I accidentally push nine instead of zero and then they extinguish you know what I mean don't want them to die or go out because I had done them before like I pushed the wrong button and then my finger slips and then I end up extinguishing like I don't know sometimes I have like 50 torches on me because you know I have a whole stack because I'm doing cave exploring and yeah I'm not sure if that was a entrance to a cave or if that was just a hole we're gonna go check you know what if I actually got those foxes I might get some uh I might actually get some fat from them. Because they, they do have fat. I don't care about the bush meat, I just want the fat. Get off me. Can't move. Oh. Can't see. Yeah, that. Oh, okay, got him. 
I just want to see if he has a fat. If he has a fat, I'm going to take it. I don't care about the bones right now. Yeah, see, I told you, you guys. Fat is so valuable in this game. And so is the hide. I don't care about the meat and the bones. I really don't. I know I just picked it up, but I'm going to drop it. Yeah, we're going to get that other one. Because where is he going to go, right? Where is he going to go? Where is he going to go? I mean, he's scared. Yeah. Oh, you guys. Oh, my gosh. Right here. Copper. See? Good thing we are exploring. We need, we need to know where all the copper is. Because we're going to need to advance and get some tools here soon. Okay, where'd he go? Yeah, go in the water because you know you're going to get stuck. Don't want him to get away. There we go. Sounded like, sounded like a wolf. Didn't that sound like a wolf? That's supposed to be... Wolves and foxes make different sounds but for some reason that sounds like a wolf that's scary i hope there's not a wolf up ahead and he had two hides instead of one um you know what i might get the meat i don't care about the bones but i might get the meat and we'll go grab the other meat from the other one that i threw away or did i throw that you guys know where that was did it fall down Or was it over here? I don't want the bones. <laughs> the rabbit is gonna drown down there. But look, we got we got fat. Told you guys. Gotta gotta listen to me. Oh there it is. Here's the meat. Okay, I'm gonna take the meat. I'm not gonna worry about the bones. How much of that food? Okay, yeah, we're gonna need to put some berries in our inventory because that's almost gone. Um, what I'm gonna do is because that food is almost gone, we're gonna go ahead and put that away. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put the berries on me so I actually have food on me. We're gonna put that away, that away, that away. I'm gonna keep the wood and well you know what we don't need the torches. Well yeah, I don't need the torches because I have my oil with me. And I'm gonna have the wood and sticks because we're gonna if we find more hollows, we're you know we're gonna pick up sticks by accident. Um, so we have two more spots um, for stuff. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Oops. I wasted a berry by accident. Uh, okay. Okay, so we're good. So we did get a little attacked um, from the foxes, but you know what? I don't care. I got some fat. Okay, now let's try and get some peat. If we can't find peat, then we need to head back soon. Um, I'm going to grab this only because we have pine on us. I must have missed this when we got, got it earlier. Yeah, because I, I planted that pine seed. Okay, so it's almost been about an hour now, chat, so I do have to wrap this up here soon, for, shortly. Um, we haven't find we haven't found any peat, um, but we do got more fat, and we did take care of all of our um, our. We did some more pottery, so I'm very happy with that. We were still productive. I mean, it's a good thing I have these berries on me, because now I can grab these as well. 
and oh my gosh, I don't need this because that's taking up another inventory for a different type of berry, but I'm going to do it just because I see it. If I have to, I could always drop these sticks. Okay, you guys need to pray for me. We need this peat. Why is it so hard to find? If I kill that sheep, I'll get a lot of meat. That ram. But tch, we don't need it. We, we need to be serious. We need to find peat. I don't know why it's taken this long. Because honestly, I usually find peat so easily. And we haven't found it yet. Hi, Mr. Ram. I'm just looking if there's a hog. Oh! Oh, he hit me. That wasn't very nice. I should kill you, but I'm not going to. Um, we found copper, you guys. That's great. Another copper location. So we're going to be set once I actually... Maybe on the next episode, if we can't find the, the peat, maybe we'll go to all these locations and pick up our copper so we can start the copper copper age. Because this is a lot of nuggets. I mean, we only need, like I said, 40 nuggets to start our process. We're going to go over here and please find peat. I, I need peat and... We got so oh yeah, remember we needed cattails as well. So if we can't find Pete, I'll have to just collect all these cattails because we need the cattails. Oh <gasps> you see the hollow? You know you see it. I have my crosser on there. My cursor on there. Let's get that shit. Let's go. Isn't it crazy how like I haven't found Pete, but I find everything else. What is in here, you guys? What do you think? Oh, <gasps> spelt. I mean, there's probably other stuff in there, but let's get the, let's get this. I hope it's more than one thing. I like when there's oh, there's mushrooms too. Wow, my inventory. Okay, look, we got acacia. We have a. I don't care about the birch seed. I don't care about the birch seed. And there's only what one little mushroom. Big deal. But yeah, I'm I'm happy for the acacia. I think we have one at the house as well. Um, can't remember, but it's awesome. Let's go ahead and get our inventory because we found another hollow. So that's two chat. We already found two. Let's get this other stuff. And it's a stick. Um, we're gonna put that in there. Um, this is not that important. Um, but whatever. And another earthworm casing. I don't really know how that works again. Um, I heard that, like, you put it in the dirt and it, like, you can get extra, um, worms. Because you could use the worms for your bait. Um, because, you know, it, it's hard. If you don't want to use your meat, you can just use worms for a bait. Which is, you know, that's good for fishing. Um, but I don't have a problem putting berries or um, meat on there. It's To me, it's not that big of a deal. I don't know if I want to have earthworm casings. I mean, I guess you can use it as fertilizer for your dirt. So we could, excuse me, we could use that for that. Um, I don't know if I want to spend one whole inventory for that meat. I don't care about bush meat. Uh, let's see here. Did I already throw the other sticks away? Oh, those were the sticks I, I threw. Okay, we're going to throw those as well. And there's only one mushroom, so I'm going to eat it. I'm not going to waste it. We, we ate the other mushroom that we got from that. But, ugh, oh, I love finding these, um... I love finding these stupid, um, so this one holds 10, that holds 10. I love finding these, because th these are our little storage, because we don't have chests yet, so we're using these as our um, storage. Um, so yeah, we got this full right now. We got, we got the seeds, we got the fat. Okay, we're going to have to head home. Unfortunately, we have not found any kind of peat for our, for us. Um, I put the torches away. Yeah, that's right. I was like, what am I missing? Um, 
yeah so i think we're just gonna grab some of these cattails and then head home because unfortunately we're not having any luck finding the peat we're just not lucky but maybe the next run we might you know what i mean i'm gonna grab these obviously because i have them in my inventory already yeah it's a bummer we couldn't we couldn't find our um uh, so we have spelt and sunflower seeds on us. Um, I'm just looking at these trees just in case these are hollows as well. I'm not seeing any holes on these ones. I'm not going to grab that because that's cranberries. We don't have that on us. I don't see any resin on these trees or... It doesn't look like any hollows. <gasps> oh, I took it back. Remember I said I don't see any leaking resin, but look, it's right there. You can't tell because of these stupid um, branches. That's why you have to, like, put your... I told you, you guys, you guys have to put your cursor on on the stuff because you sometimes you just you don't know. Um, and we are going to get it because... It does respawn. We're gonna put resin tree. And we're gonna mark it. We have a few spots. Remember the ones in the beginning where we our world spawn? Um, so we can definitely get those later. That's something we're gonna have to do as well. We're gonna have to get all of our resin. Gotta take a look at this tree. Make sure it's not a hollow as well. Or a resin. We're gonna get a few of these cattails and we're gonna have to head home. But luckily we can go in the water so I'm not scared about anything eating us. Because we'll be pretty safe. I don't see any peat at all. Let me go just check over here really quick. I see some cranberries and some rye but we only have spelt. Our inventory is pretty full. I don't see any hollow. Let me check if I see any um, peat. I see cattails. I'm not going to get any more berries because we're okay on berries. I'm so sad though. We're going to have to explore all of this green stuff later. Um. But I'm happy there's lots of um, cattails over here. But we need to end this episode here. We got quartz over here. I'm going to mark this. Because we will need quartz later if we want to have any windows in our homes. We're going to need some. So let's get a few cattails and then head home and wrap this episode up. sad we can't find peat but like I told you you'll have an area that you spawn in it where you'll have an abundance of one thing but you'll be lacking the other things like we got resin but yeah no peat when we need that for cooking and firewood but I guess it's not a big deal because we have an abundance of wood at our disposal we'll just have to be using a lot of firewood instead of you know peat when cooking or whatever but for our ores we're gonna have charcoal so that's not a problem like i said we have a lot of wood i just like to use peat like when i do my pit kilns and when i do my cooking i like peat because it it's hotter and it lasts longer you know i can get up to 90 degrees where firewood is only 700 so like i said i prefer peat but if we don't have it we got to use what we have so it's not a big deal. When we're not looking for peat, watch, we'll find peat. But while we are looking, like, literally looking for it, we couldn't find it. It's crazy. Because when I don't need peat, I see peat everywhere. But we'll grab some of these cattails, because we're going to need them if we find bees. Or if, um... 
we want to make more fishing line to do trot lines and fish baskets, we're going to need this rope, the cattails to make rope. So this will come in very handy. We need to eat something. We're going to go ahead and eat these ones because there's less of them. So we got so we got quite a bit of cattails, which is great. We'll get these and then we'll go home. And wrap this episode up. And we have to remember after in a couple honestly in a couple hours these drifters are gonna actually spawn. I just realized that. Because remember how it said one more day, we better head home. Um the drifters are gonna come and they're gonna attack me and it's nighttime so I want to go home we need to head home I totally forgot about that I don't care I took damage I want to go home oh is that a cave oh yeah that's a cave or a home but we didn't die we're good I'm just trying to hurry because, like I said, the drifters are going to come in less than one hour. One hour in game. And that's why I love the oil lamp. Because, look, I could run and go in the water. Our oil lamp, we can still see no matter what. We got light. So we have a permanent light source. So that's why I told you I was so excited to get the oil lamp. Even though it's not as bright as a torch, I don't care. We're safe. See, that really lit up our home was the pit kennel. But we need to add another, we got fat, we're going to add another oil lamp right here. Because the other one's in the house, you can't see it from outside. Um, so yes, yeah, so let's go ahead and light the other one. At least, we need to do at least one. And yeah, we have six on us, but we also have more, more too. I think that's the first resin we have, though, too. Um, so that's good. Yeah, so we'll probably use these for our as fertilizer. Because I'm not worried about making more worms. I don't care. We have so many fruit that we can use as our bait that that's not a problem for me. See? Monsters be uh, begin to appear. I told you guys I wasn't playing around. Oh shoot. Hold on. We gotta put this outside. There we go. We have a light source when the pit kiln's not on. And see, they could throw stones at us um, through our windows. So when monsters are appear, you're gonna hear a lot of moaning and groaning chat. Guess what? Those are the drifters. Those freaking apes. They make so much noise, and trust me, you're going to tell me later, um, wow, they're so noisy, or they groan too much. Yep, told you. They're very annoying. Trust me, you won't like them. I need to get my basket, and I have to open this door so I can do that. And shut this <laughs> immediately, because they're... they're I mean, let's check the rift activity. It says medium, so there could be a lot of them running around. Maybe not by us, but they are somewhere. Let's go ahead and put our stuff away. Okay, so I thought we had an acacia. We don't. We had, it was the K-pop. Okay, there we go. So now we have all these different cool seeds. Um, we can put these up upstairs. Um... We have a spelt and we have a sunflower seed, so we're going to grow those upstairs because we still have a few spots open and we can go ahead, we have two of these, um, we could place those, Let's go ahead and close that box and that box, we're going to put our animal hide and our fat, now that we have our oil lamp and a couple lamps made, um, we need, we were talking about how my hand baskets only give me three inventory. 
if we go ahead and pull, pull up our handbook and we type in, um, they have a hunter backpack, that's going to give us um, four slots versus four, um, three. So I don't want to waste our huge ones um, or large. Or actually, wait. Yeah, you can do medium as well. Um, I want to use our small ones, which is our um, small hides, so we can make our hunter backpacks. So it takes three for one backpack, right? So we're going to use six. We're going to use our small ones. We're going to go ahead and bring up our crafting um, grid. And because it takes three for one backpack, we're going to do six. Oh, but that's going to take six hides. That's correct. So you know what? Until we get more, let's just do one backpack for now. So we're going to do one, two, three. So for each hide, you're going to do uh, one lump of fat. But for that particular backpack, it takes three. So, yeah, so we're going to do three. We're going to go ahead and keep them inside of our... They have to cure. So right now they're at zero percent. Um, that does take some time to cure. Um, what are we missing? Oh, we need another knife because we broke our other one. Okay. So at least we got that going. Um, so hopefully sometime in next episode, this can be done. Uh, this is my food. My torches. Um, this can go away. We need to, we're just emptying out our hollow right now. Our inventory. We're gonna put our fruit there. I'm gonna keep this on me because it's gonna last me a while and you go through berries pretty quick. The the satiation's not that high. It's only it's only eighty. Well I guess that's the same as a mushroom, but see mushrooms are better because they're gonna last a long time for us. But see how our vessel is kind of full now, getting full. Um, we gotta cook this up, um, but that's why our pit kiln's going. So once our pit kiln is done, I'm gonna go ahead and um, make some more meals. I think that's a good thing we didn't use all of our fat. Um, so we have two extra um, hollows that we could use now. Um, let's see here. We only have, um, this is for cooking. I guess we could put a couple, well, I don't want to put one here. I want to put a tool rack there for the hammer and chisel and shears. Um, but I mean, I guess we could put two here, but then that blocks the window. Cause that's going to go right in front of it. Um, and I guess we don't need that window. We, I guess we could block that one off as well. I mean, if we have to, we can put some outside. That's not a big deal also. Um, so let's just go ahead and put the other one here. gonna set this no I don't want to pick it up I want to I want to I want to place it oh I have to I forgot I have to shift okay so there's that can I get out I mean I guess I have this one spot right here as well and above uh, but I might yeah I don't want to cover that I might put another oil lamp right there um, so we have one more, if I put one here, it's going to block that. I can, I guess I could put it up at the top. Let's see what it, no, because then I can't see. Yeah, see how it's so big? It's, it just, it kind of covers everything. If I put it here, then I can't reach or have access to that. You know what I'm saying? And if I put it here, it's just going to go. But you know what? We've got lots of space. Let's go ahead and put this outside. I don't hear any drifters and it's morning, so I think we're okay. Um, we could put this here and then this could be our, um, our, uh, 
our wood chest, you know, instead of putting the wood in there, we could put um, other resources in there. We could just put this here. This will be honestly our wood chest. Okay, we can do that. Let's go ahead and plant our seeds since we only have two. And we only have two. So. Yeah, we need to water, but we're going to have to do that next episode because I do need to wrap this up. This has been over over an hour for my episode, so... I'm going to have to put these. Okay. Okay. Okay, we had to put that back on our bowl. Oh, it didn't do it. gonna go in here just to be safe in case there are structures. Okay chat, so we're gonna go ahead and wrap up this episode. I want to thank you guys for um, watching me on episode 4. Go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already subscribed and turn that notification bell if you want to see my next future videos. Until then, we'll see you next time. Thank you. Goodbye.